High Plains Prospectors here. Terp, scrap iron, pull tab tiler. We got permission to come out and do some metal detecting around this old homestead structure. I'll kind of show it to you here. These properties like this are they're scattered all throughout the country, especially this part of Kansas. And you just randomly stumble across them. These people just bought this property and uh, told us that they had an old foundation. This is one of a few. Today we're going to focus on this one. The, the other one apparently was a stagecoach stop, which we'll go hit it another day. I'll hit this from another angle. As you can see, this is uh, basically just an old stone foundation, basement wall basically. Long gone, but uh, kind of gives us some nice territory to metal detect and hopefully we'll find something. There's also a old barn over here. Looks like it's kind of been redone in the recent past. We know there's going to be a lot of garbage, but hopefully we can find some treasure. Stay tuned. All right, we're just kind of hitting the outskirts of this old building and I got an iron signal. I didn't get it on video. It's not really too amazing, but I think I know what that is. I think that is a uh, basically like an iron stand. You can take a hot iron off the stove, set it on here, stop it from burning the surface. But uh, that's neat. I mean, it kind of ages the house. There's a lot of trash, a lot of targets, but we're going to keep at it. We'll show you if we find anything. So I uh, come down into this basement. There's a lot of scrap metal. Um, I couldn't get that up by myself. Uh, we'll probably do a little joint cleanup on this and come in here and rake the area. But this corner didn't have any garbage in it really. And I got a signal, kind of erratic, but heavy, big signal. And when you get a signal like that in a basement like this, you dig the target. But I don't know if you guys can see that. It could be nothing, it could be junk, but there appears to be some sort of box right there. So I'm going to just kind of gingerly dig around it. Could just be a piece of sheet metal too. What is it in there? Oh, it's a little dirty. Uh, thought I found something neat, but it's just a piece of sheet, sheet metal. A good uh, hit here in this hole. And uh, you can see that uh, they're metal detecting way up there, uh, more by the barn and the structure. Uh, it was pretty trashy up there, so I decided to come down the hill. Uh, the creek is down this way, so I figured that they would come down this way through uh, getting water and stuff like that. But anyway, uh, got uh, got a good target here. Um, I kind of just saw it laying here, but uh, you can see it's a... Uh, it's a bullet. It's a fire bullet here, and uh, it smashed pretty good. So uh, turned out to be a good, good uh, little find here. All right, out here metal detecting, finding some pretty neat stuff. We'll show you here in the end. So much garbage. We've got a kind of a lack of live digs, but I was uh, walking around out here and stumbled across another foundation that we did not know about. And this one looks pretty old. It's actually just rock floor, too. Wow, this is interesting. I'm going to have to get the guys over here. All right, so I just started poking around this rock floor and got a signal under it. It's not the greatest find, but it is neat. I have found one of these before. Not actually quite this big, but it is uh, goes on like a yoke for a harness for an ox or something. Pretty neat, it's a cool find. It's under one of these rocks. Hopefully I find some more targets under some of these rocks. All right, we're cleaning our pouches out right now. Just got done metal detecting around this old structure and there is a lot of metal in the ground. We had to contend with a lot of iron. Found some pretty neat pieces today. Um, some cool buckles, pieces of a, I guess what you call a yoke from a harness or from a, yeah, from a harness. Bunch of iron, axe head, unidentifiable pieces. It's our first hunt. Usually starts out being a cleanup mission, and I'm sure we'll come back, and we're really excited to hit this stagecoach that's 
uh, this old stagecoach stop right down the road. Don't forget to visit our website at www.highplainsprospectors.com where you can find the finest in metal detecting and treasure hunting supplies.